Okay, this is the third time I'm trying to record this. Somebody keeps calling. We got flat roof getting water in, rotting out, and the post is sinking here on the end and here. So water's coming in, finding its way in through here. This bottom 18 inches of old membrane is completely shot. You can see down to it, there's cracks all the way through. And what that's doing is reflecting to the header on, that is below us here. And it's been getting wet and decaying. You can see water stains. You can see this rust water stains just on the other side of that post. And more importantly, you can see how this is actually the top of this post here is rotting out. So we got a little bit of a can of worms here. You can see the yellowness back in that corner, which is signs of that water from the upper post being an issue coming in. So I'm suspect we're going to take this apart and find that this header is going to be in rough shape. But this leaking had reflected all the way down to the first floor plates. And as you can see here, the first floor plates are, are sunken on each side. And that's why this aluminum is buckling, because aluminum isn't moving and the posts are sinking down into the foundation. So I've got to come up with, uh, well, you can see all the way the water that's been coming in the header. You see right where the, where, where the aluminum trim is. That's all water stains right in through there. So that's been going on for years. You can see that up one horizontal spot right, right there where water stains have been coming through and up against the post. So we got to get that resolved. But the only way to do that is we're going we're gonna to have to support this whole, this whole porch area. Look at this side here. This, is, this has been shot for a while. And I know that we're going to find that this is going to be rotted. So we can come in and put a roof on and arrest the water from coming in. But it isn't really going to be the right way to do it. They, they need to look at lifting this both roof lines up, supporting both roof lines up. And digging this bottom plate out. And uh, that would be the right way to do it. So I'll have to give him his options and see which way he wants to do it. But this is the one that we, uh, that we shingled, oh, I think it's probably about four months ago or so. Not even that long, maybe three months, two months. We did the house and garage and did the overhangs and the gutters. So, we'll keep you posted.